Good evening. Hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening. How are you doing, Gilberto? Roberto? I'm Excellent. fine, teacher. I have happy weekend. Thank you. Oh my God. Okay, that is good. What about you, Robert? How was it your was, weekend? It was very exciting because I I had very busy and different activities. But right now I am ready for the class. Okay. That is perfect. Welcome, Jose Andres. How are you doing? It's listening. Oh, it's a, it's a oriented. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you so much for being here on time. Okay, it's, it's okay, Jose Andres, don't worry. Okay, thank you so much for being here on time. Uh, today is the class number six, 16. We're going to start the unit number three. Thank you so much. Um, for the ones that are already complete, completed all the assignments. Okay, let me share my screen. Welcome, Mauricio, Kathy. How are you doing today? Good Kathy? evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your Fine. day? Fine. Was good? Yes. Okay. That is perfect. What about you, Hassan? Uh, oh, sorry, Mauricio. Hello, teacher. Hi, fine. Okay. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you so much for asking. That's fine. Thank you. How was your weekend? Well, a little busy. Busy? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just working. Working hard. Uh, yes. Yeah, working hard. Hmm. Where are your days off? Which days do you do you rest? Uh, me mm -hmm. uh, Your day off. Uh, my day off is uh on Sunday. On Sunday. Yeah, just yeah, Sunday. Yeah, I work until uh Saturday. Until twelve. Uh, at noon. At noon. Ah, yes. okay. Yes. Good. But you said that was busy because you work at home, right? The, there are a lot of activities that always we need to do at home. Even though we don't work, we don't uh, earn a salary, but we we have a lot of activities that we need to, to do at home. Uh, okay, perfect. Welcome, Rodrigo. Hello, How are you doing? Everyone. Hello. I'm fine and I'm fine. And you? I'm very well. Thank you so much for asking. How was your weekend? Uh, it's uh, pretty moving because I uh, I had to go to supermarket and and had to do other things because this Friday, uh, this fifty Friday, uh, this fifty September, I'm going to. I will go to San Miguel, mm -hmm. so I I have to do some things uh, to have the the all the long weekend free. Oh, okay. You will have uh Friday fifteen off, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. But you ha you need to complete all the tasks to have it free. Uh huh. Okay. Good. 
Welcome, Maria Leticia, Mauricio Benavides. Hi. Hi. How are you doing today? Fine. Fine. Thanks. A little okay. tired, but right. <laughs> yes, I'm really sorry about that. It happens because we have to work the complete day, right? Sometimes we have to get up at probably before 5 a.m. I don't know if that yes. is your case. And then we have to work the complete the complete day. Maybe you have to, to drive, I don't know, maybe one hour and then arrive home. And yes, I know that is difficult. A lot of activities yes. during the day. <laughs> 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 okay good uh let me start um today well we have a lesson objective okay we are going to start the unit number three that is the first lesson is about monitoring personal and at the end we're going to have a conversation uh to practice Okay, at the end of this lesson, you will be able to interpret the information presented in a staff schedule chart. Okay, that will be the main uh, lesson objective for this class. Okay, um, I have an activity that is working about work schedule vocabulary. Let me... I have it here. Okay. Yes, I have it here. Okay, we're going to match the definition with the word that you can see there. We have employee. What else do we have? Position. Uh-huh. What else? Please read the vocabulary that we have there. Uh Okay, sorry, just a moment. Um, let me see. Roberto. Please read the vocabulary that we have there. Employee, position, schedule. What else, what else do we have, Robert? Can you hear me? Roberto Carlos? I guess he is having issues. Okay, Gilberto, do you mind if you read the, the vocabulary that we have in colors? Uh, a role of person has, has work. Uh, mm hmm. Supervisor. Supervisor. Uh -huh. What else? Overtime, department, approve, contact, post, the employer, request, casual, uh, position, employee, front of house. Okay. So all that words that we have, uh, in colors, we are going to match then with the um, information that we see. Okay, number okay. one. Yes, number one. Um, a, a role a person has at work, supervisor. Supervisor, a role a person has at work. Do you think that is a supervisor? Mm. It could be position, okay? Because we're talking about different positions. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, number two, to ask for. Request. Which word? Request, okay, request. Because you are going to ask for that request. Okay, so this will be request and this will be position. Okay, number three, the dining area of the restaurant. Which word do you think that is there? 
Mm -hmm. Someone says? Front of house. Front of house, correct. Front of house. Yes, good. Okay, a person who for for the organis okay for the company of organization In supervisor the... a person who employee mm -hmm. employee okay very good Okay, a chart with planned events, day or times. A schedule. schedule. Okay, very good. Schedule. Mm -hmm. A person who oversees workers. Employer. Supervisor. supervisor. In this case, is supervisor. Okay, to display information for others to read. Post. Mm -hmm. Very good. A method of communication. Contact. Contact. Okay. And a specific area of a workplace. Department. 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 Okay, good. To accept or to agree. Approve. Approve. Oh, very good. <coughs> An organization or company that employs workers. Employer. 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 Overtime. Overtime. Uh -huh. That is Overtime. for extra, extra hours, hours. Extra hours outside, outside of normal, of normal work, work hours. hours. Very sure. good. Yes. Excuse me, what the difference when this says display and show? Displayed and? And, and show? Show is both, when... Both means mostrar, maybe. Mm -hmm. Let me look for a definition, the difference between them. Both are the same. So remember, um, there are some words that are synonyms. Difference between okay. between you display said show when you uh, and display. Mm -hmm. It must be six. Okay, let me let me give you. It says the word the word pair show and high are more active and dynamic. Okay, like display is more static. For example, if I'm showing you a book, I'm revealing it or directing your attention to it. But if I am displaying it. I've just set set it out for people to observe. Uh-huh, to observe uh possibly. Okay, so in this case, yes, show showing something is more um uh, specific, give giving you more details. But if you just display, it is just for you to to just see. Uh but no no like in deep details. Teacher, uh, this term, uh, I heard maybe the, the seller, the seller's person when, when uh, they have to send, sell something in a, in a, in a for example, uh, end up. Mm -hmm, and, like store. And they display that their things or product to uh sell or that 
or the customer. Okay. They they are similar, right? But the, the difference between is that one is more specific and the other one is more general. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Another question that you may have about this vocabulary here. <clears throat> uh huh. No. No new words for you. Everything is clear. Teacher, in Spanish, what mean? Uh, em employee, uh, IT. A uh, person who for the company of organization. Employee. Una persona quien por la who compañía work. de... Who, who work for the company organization. I guess he, there, here is missing who work for. Ah, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Who work. Who work for, uh-huh. Who work for, okay. <clears throat> okay, uh, good. Teacher, the last one. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh huh. Uh, overseas. What's mean? Overseas. Uh, it has different meanings. I mean, show you just a moment. <clears throat> so it is supervise, okay? Supervise who okay. super su supervise the work, okay? Oh, but okay. look at the spelling overseas. Uh, oh, okay, yes, oh, okay. the spelling. Overseas. So yes, there is another word that we say overseas, but when it's in another country, someone from when you are in another country. <clears throat> but it, the difference is just one letter <clears throat> instead of E here mm -hmm. it is A yes. uh -huh. for example here right? Over, overseas. look at this overseas you pronounce overseas. the same uh -huh. mm -hmm. it, is in a, it is in or to a foreign country especially one across of the sea Mm -hmm. It it means another from another country, so but the difference is just one letter, but it, the pronunciation is the same. Overseas. Teacher, I can I say I was overseas. Yes, you can say that. Just to an extranjero, that was mm -hmm. correct. Uh, okay. Look at the difference. Right, it is minimum. <clears throat> Okay, good. So in this case, if that it if it doesn't have the S, it says overseas. But if it has the le the S overseas, it sounds the same here. Overseas. We're going to interpret. It depends of the context. Okay. Okay. Let me see the chat. Study the gente. Okay. <gasps> okay. Be careful, Daniela. <clears throat> okay. Uh, well, thank you. We're going to continue. Okay. What is your daily schedule like at work? Okay. Who is in, in charge of organizing a staff schedules in your in your company? Um, do you have an, a specific uh, schedule like, uh, for example, from eight a.m. to five p.m. every every day from Monday to Friday? It never change, or do you have like a um different schedules? Mm -hmm. mm, especially in my case, uh, I have 
like a schedule routine. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, at first, uh, the seven, I review or check it, uh, the old uh, check in and check off the, the stuff mm -hmm. of yesterday. Yes. Yes, and then I review email. Okay, but uh, in but the, the afternoon. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, the specific question is if if you have a like um permanent uh, schedule that it doesn't change, it is not flexible because if your schedule is fle is flexible, it means that one day you can uh start at 7 other day you can start at 9 a.m but also it will change the the time that you will leave the company or sometimes you can work on 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 weekends and you can have weekdays off That is the question. If you have a like a a, um, a specific schedule, or or do you, or is um flexible. different schedule flexible? Uh huh. Jose Andres, what about you? Yes, teacher. But when you means uh, schedule is like the same things every day in every week, or a specific activity that I can do it every week. Because in my case, I can say that, for example, when I arrive to my job, I have to organize the different security works. Organize, to bring, organization, organize. Uh -huh. Organize, yes, organize the, the security works. Then they have to, they have to bring security for the different customers, clients. So, for example, uh, to a.m. to a.m. from nine thirty every week, from Monday to Friday, I have to take the note of the security words to arrive to the company, and then I have to I have to it's like um take note for the different customer that missing that missing um, security is worse. So I have to, it's like, uh, I have to send the different security words from these customers that they don't have um, security in this moment. Mm -hmm. So this activity is from Monday to Friday, every week. And of course, when I have to work on, on weekends, I have to do this activity too. Mm -hmm. I understand. But the question here is how look like, okay, how look like it doesn't, um, it is not about the task or activities that you do. It is about the time that you work. Oh, okay. So mm -hmm. I can say that my, my schedule is from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. To 6 like p.m. Every day from Monday to Friday? Every day from Monday to Friday, yes. It doesn't we can change. Know. It doesn't it change. Doesn't. Okay. Yes, okay. Okay. Uh-huh. That is that is a way that you're going to, to explain. We're going to see an example later. And who is in charge of organizing the staff schedules in your company? Do you have any specific uh employee who do that? Who organize the uh, uh the different schedules or the in schedules company, are are yes? Yeah, I'm sorry. To... <laughs> in ahead. my company, the uh, boss of uh, human resources is human the, resources. Uh, yes, human resources. Okay. Good. Okay, very good. So, um, we're going to have a conversation that is is about uh, how is on a schedule organized. Good. Uh, need two volunteers 
Ruben and Jenny. Me, teacher. Okay, Carlos. Okay, we have Gilberto, Jose, Maria, Lady, Julio. Okay, first will be Carlos and Maria Leticia. Go ahead, please. Okay, I am Ruben. Ruben. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, let's check your schedule for today, Jenny. All right. You have to start covering for Gladys as the hostess today from 9 to 11 a.m. Then you can go to lunch. You have to be back at 1 p.m. So that you can serve for the rest of the afternoon until 6 p.m. Will do, Ruben. Thanks for the reminder. Reminder. Okay. Reminder. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. Thank you okay. so much. Okay, now Thanks. Robert and Lady. Okay. Hey, let's check your schedule for today, Jenny. All right. You have to start covering for Gladys at the hostess today from 9 to 11 a.m. Then you can go to lunch. You have to be back at 1 p.m. so that you can serve for the rest of the afternoon until 6 p.m. Will do, Ruben. Thanks for the reminder. 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 It is difficult. Okay. Reminder. Reminder. Mm -hmm. Reminder. Reminder. Okay. Good. Um. Hostess. Hostess. Okay. Okay. Go ahead, Jose, Andres, and Gilberto. Okay, teacher. Okay. Mm, okay. Let's check your schedule for today. Jenny? All right. You have to start covering for Gladys as the hostess, hostess today from 9 to 11 a.m. Then you can go to lunch. You have to be back at 1 p.m. so that you can serve for the rest of the afternoon until 6 p.m. We'll do, we'll do, Ruben. Thank you for reminder. 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 For the reminder. reminder. Okay. Good. Very good. <clears throat> Thank you so much. Okay, Julio. Who wants to participate with Julio? Me, teacher. Okay, Rodrigo. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. Let's check your schedule for today, Jenny. All right. Uh, you have to start covering for Gladys as the hostess today from 9 to 11 a.m. Uh, then you can go to lunch. Uh, you have to be back at 1 p.m. So that you can serve for, for the rest of the afternoon until 6 p.m. Will do, Ruben. Thanks for the reminder. Thank you. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay. It's Vincent uh, Mauricio Buruca, right? Mauricio? Yes, teacher. Okay. Uh, Hazel, are you available? Hey, Hazel? Kathy? Yes. Okay. Do you mind, Kathy, please? Okay. Okay, let's just do your schedule for today, Jenny. All right. You have to start covering for Gladys at the hostess today from 9 to 11 a.m. Then you can go to lunch. You have to be back at 1 p.m. so that you can serve for the rest of the afternoon until 6 p.m. 
Will do, Ruben. Thanks for the reminder. Okay, good. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay, we're going to move on. Here we have an example of uh, vocabulary. Okay, we have an executive chef, server, host or hostess, okay, kitchen manager and cashier. Okay, we're going to um we're going to match the vocabulary and the definitions. Okay, I will give you one minute to read them. The fears is cashier. Okay, number one. Let me let me take the text here. And this one is number five. Cashier, person handling payments in a restaurant, right? Number two. Number two. Number two. A person in charge of creating menus, managing description staff, and food. Okay. That will be an executive chef. That is number one. Okay, uh, okay. A person who hires a staff who is in food and makes sure everyone is trained. Kitchen manager. Kitchen manager. Kitchen manager. Okay, good, very good. That will be number four. Okay, waiter who or waitress who attends customers with food and drink. Server. Server. Okay. Server. It will be number two. A person who greets a uh, arriving guest. Coster. Comes then into a restaurant and sits then. Coster. Okay. Very good. Do you have questions about this? Mm -hmm. I think that, um, we have to switch the answers. Switch. I think the person in church switch. Mm -hmm. I think the person in charge creating minutes it's a it's a kitchen, kitchen manager. manager. Yes. And okay. that will be here. And number one, do you think it is a person? No. Do you think this one is, is four, right? Yes. This one, four. Uh -huh. And, and this the person's one will be... staff is the executive chief. One. Yes. Okay. A person who tries a staff, which is food, and makes sure everyone is trained. Executive chef. Kitchen manager, a person in charge creating many and many. Mm -hmm. It could be, but they are like a they have like a similar roles, right? Kitchen manager and executive chef. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Um, Teacher. Yes. Excuse me. Uh, I don't have very clear the the means of are for this host. Host. host the, 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 oh, host. The person that's greeting, maybe. Yes, correct. That or is number three. Me. Uh huh. Because it's a person who who um attend okay uh, who assist customers it could be it could be in a in a airplane it could be in a um, train it could be in a restaurant that is a host <clears throat> okay okay 
Good. Um, but another the question is, that you made? But the host is, is uh, don't uh, service the food. Mm. Not necessary. No, not necessary. In this case, it's like uh, just making Only greeting. making them feel good, right? That they have someone that can help them. For uh, example, aha. Okay. Uh -huh, for example, a restaurant is sit then, okay, and welcome then greeting. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is thank you. Okay. Good. So let me continue. Okay. According to, let me see when that's Jenny Chip Star. Okay, according to the conversation that we that we saw here, read it again, and then we're going to answer these questions. When does Jenny Chip start? What is Jenny's job in the restaurant? And what does Jenny have to do from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m.? Mm -hmm. 1 Okay, lady, I'm so sorry. Stay there as a listener, okay? If you cannot hear. <laughs> Sorry, ladies, is is sending me messages because it's raining a lot. Okay, when does Jenny shift start? Jenny okay. start teacher Jenny from eight to, uh, to nine to eleven a.m. to eleven. Mm -hmm. From nine to eleven, right? That is her shift. What is Jenny's job in the restaurant? She is the server. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, the server. What does Jenny have to do from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m.? Teacher, you can show the previous screen, please. This one? Uh, may I show the previous screen, please? The previous. Yes. Do you mean the conversation? Yes. Please. Here it is. Can you see it? Yes, thank you. Uh huh. The question is What does Jenny have to do from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m.? Serve. Serve. Cover Gladys, right? No, no, no. It says, then you can go to lunch. You have to be back at 1 p.m. That, that you can serve for the rest of the afternoon on the 6th. Okay. Yes. Uh, from 9... From 9 to 11 is uh, that she, she has to cover Gladys, right? And then do the other shift from 1, from one to 6. Serve. Oh, serve. Correct. Okay, good. Um, now we have another part of vocabulary related to, to work, shift, and everything that we can talk about. We have work schedule, break, shift, overtime, and call in. We have the first one that says work schedule, a chart that presents a list of employees 
the days of the week and times of the day they are required to work. Okay. Now, break. What will be the definition for break? A small period of time. of time when a person can stop, can stop. working to it or rest. Okay. <clears throat> okay, a small period of time when a person can stop working to it or rest. Okay. What about shift? The last one. The time of the day when a person works. Mm hmm the time of the day when a person works, okay? It is uh, the complete scheduled day, right? That is the shift. If you work from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m., that is your period. Shift okay, is, that is your shift. Shift is turno. Yes, correct. What about oh. overtime? Overtime. When you work more than yeah. regular working hour in a in day, day or week. week. Okay, very good. When you receive extra money, double payment for that hours. That is good, right? When your supervisor tell you, do you want to work extra hours today? So you will receive double payment. That is good. If you can do it, of course, if you have time. Okay, call in. Call in. The telephone on your work line. You let them know that you are going to be asking online. Mm -hmm. to telephone your workplace to let them know that you are going to be absent or late. Very good. Okay. Questions about that? Do you have questions? No? No, teacher. Very good. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, now we're going to think about the schedule that we have and other uh, co-workers have in your workplace. For example, here, we have the days of the week from Tuesday to Saturday. Okay, in this company, the employees rest or have they off Sunday and Monday. They work from Tuesday to Saturday. Okay, we have Laura, Thomas, Sofia, and Carlos. We have the kitchen, the kitchen manager. Okay, we have uh, the dishwashing. We have the bartender. <clears throat> and we have the training, the trainer. Or uh, let me see, there are some people. Okay, in this case, wait, okay, Carlos, it worked like a trainer, training, and server. Okay. But Laura is the key the kitchen manager. She worked just four days, okay, from 12 to 6 every day, okay? She has 30 minutes break, okay, every, every time. It is a part-time between 12 to 6. And she has day off on Saturday, okay? Sure. Yes? How do you say horario rotativo? Flexible schedules. Um, flexible skips. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Thomas is a ditch ditch washing. So he works on Tuesday at the same time from 12 to 6. Okay. Day off Wednesday. Uh Thursday. Oh, Thursday has a different schedule that is between 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. And Friday. Uh, same schedule between tw 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. and Saturday too. Every day he has 30 minutes break. Good. And then we have Sophia. 
that is a bartender. Um, she works from 4 p.m. to 11 p.m. Uh, according to the schedule, she will work just three days this week because Friday and Saturday is vacations for her, okay? She has vacations. And the same, uh, 30 minutes break, just one break. Okay, then Carlos training on Tuesday between eight to six, okay, one hour break. And he has a complete or full schedule that is between 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. For that reason, he has one hour break. Okay, the same schedule between eight to six. Okay, from Wednesday to Friday. And he has a day off that is Saturday. Okay. We can consider that these uh, these schedules are really good <clears throat> because they they were just three, let me see, uh, four days a uh, four days in the week. Okay. So <clears throat> what I want now is that you create one similar schedule and try to remember the schedule of your uh, co-workers and the positions that they have. You are going to create like um, the position name, the schedule time, and the breaks that you receive and the days during the week. Do you remember? Do you remember someone schedule in your company or maybe someone else that has the same schedule than you? Probably you you get along with your coworkers and you know the schedule time. Okay, good. But we, before we do that, we're going to do some questions. Who is in charge of purchasing food from Tuesday to Friday, according to the schedule? Mm -hmm. Laura. Laura, right? Because she's a kitchen manager. Okay. When is the dishwasher day off? Wednesday. 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 Okay. Wednesday. How long is Thomas break? One hour. Thomas is 30 ah, minutes. 30 minutes. 30 minutes. 30 minutes. 30 minutes. Yes. What is Sophia's job in the restaurant? When the is her She's the She's the bartender. The bartender. Okay, she has vacations on Friday and Saturday. Okay, when is Carlo Carlos on training? Oh, so it means that he is on training. He's not a trainer. He's on training. What is his schedule on on Friday? Tuesday. On Tuesday. Mm -hmm. He's in training on Tuesday, and his schedule on Friday is. Server, eight to six p.m. From eight to six p.m. Eight. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Good. Um, you can use the same uh chart if you want, or you can create a new one. Okay. So in Paris now you are going to use the model above created uh a basic schedule for five employees at your company. Okay, including the position, uh, the time that they work, and the break that they receive. The days of the week they work and the day off that they have. Okay, um, let me create the, the let me create the rooms, breakout rooms. Let me ask you by, by one by one, just to make sure that you are here. Okay, Carlos and Daniela, 
available? Yes, teacher. Okay. Gilberto Benito, Hazel, are you available, Hazel? Yes. Okay, yes, good. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> okay, Jose Andres and Julia Aristides available? Yes, teacher, I'm available. Yes, okay. Kathy Briseida and Lady? Yes. Okay. okay. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, Lady. I forgot that. Sorry. But, um, okay, Kathy. Kathy, you will Deja. work. Okay, let me assign someone else to you. Mauricio Benavides. Yes, I'm here. Okay, and Roberto. So, Maria Leticia, you will work with Katy. Okay. Okay, Rodrigo. Silvia, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay. <coughs> Place you. Okay, Rolando, Gus Rolando Danilo and oh Sofia. God. Are you there, Sophie? Yes, see here. Yes. Okay, good. Thank you. Four. Lady, you will is you you will be with Kathy and Maria Leticia just to observe. If you cannot participate, it's okay. But you will be with them, okay? Okay. Okay, good. We'll open the rooms now. Mauricio Buruca, are you there? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher, I hear. Oh, okay. Are you available? Yes, yes. Oh, okay. So in that case, I will join you to team number one, where is Carlos and Daniela, okay? Okay, perfect. William Roque, what about you? I still um as a listener, can you hear me? William Roque. Um, see. See, okay. see. Uh, we have five employees. The role of the employees, for example, Carol is opening cashier. She starts 6 a.m. and the end time is 11 a.m. Yes, this okay. is, is okay yes. here. Sure. It's okay. Maria. Is the what's mean like cashier teacher? Is is como la la villera. Uh, yeah. cashier is who is charging uh who is uh charging the bills to the customers, right? 
but they, yes, I guess sir. she has a different positions. So in that case, that is a the specific role for that day. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if you can day, change if... you can delete day and just have cashier. Only cashier. Mm -hmm. sure. Okay. Uh, oh okay. no, no, no. It means that is one cashier during the day and that is one during the night because the other one is closed. Ah, is the shift. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, okay. And maybe in the other role could be a uh, night cashier, right? Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I'm, I got a teacher. <clears throat> but what do you think about this schedule, teacher? Okay, it says from 6 a.m. to 9. It means that she, she worked just uh, five hours. No, yes. less than five because it is... Oh no, the break is at 9.15 and yes. then she Until has just 11. one break. Uh-huh. I mean you are free to change the schedules, but it um it seems that she has like a part-time. Right. From six to eleven. But it is good. What is missing here? Let me see. We have the position, the role. We have the start time, the break and lunch, end time, and the hours schedule. Uh, let me see what else. We... Um, the days of the week. Which days they work? I try to uh, to add more um, or will set the schedule to add um, days of the week. Mm. But the idea in this case... Oh, it is be... just for one day, right? It is just for one day. Yes, it's, it's just one day. Mm -hmm. uh, today's day is Monday. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Or what you can do is copy and paste the same mm -hmm. uh, chart and just change the date. Mm -hmm. And also you can change the, the um, schedule in, in the days, right? It depends which date you want to change. Mm -hmm. Of course, okay. if, if you want to make it flexible. For example, yes. uh -huh. okay, but yes, you can use that template. You can explain that it's daily, it's a daily schedule. It's not weekly, but it's daily. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's diario. Yes. Okay. Okay, I try to do it, this schedule, teacher. Good. Um, Como se dice por eh, filas? Filas en Excel. Ajá. Uh -huh. I don't know. Rogue. Rogue. Rogue, ¿verdad? Rogue. Uh, okay. Uh, I L Rogue. To include days of the week. Okay, if you want. So it depends on your creativity. Uh, Daniela, are you there? Okay, I Can will be Daniela? around. Good job. We'll be around, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. So far, PM. Hi, guys. Four. You can share your screens if you want. Uh, you are you have the 
the option available? Miss, I am use this day um, notebook because I I can I just can be in one position. So I I'm I'm not on my computer. Ah, okay. Just phone and 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 notebook. Ah, okay. No problem. I, I can move so much. Okay. In my case, it's similar, teacher. You work from your no, cell no, phone, right? No, I schedule in the company. Yeah, it, it's that reason I, I'm using my notebook. Okay. It's okay. Thank you. Good. So, Mario, entonces, don Gilberto, que haga un medio turno el sábado. Sí. Sería siempre que empiece. Ok. Y... Aquí sería... Lunch. Lunch. Ahí está. Y es lunch. Ok. Uh, basically, it's the same activities. Yes, it's the same activities. Uh, so, uh -huh. but we tenemos, tenemos que poner en launch. Um, bueno, ahí le voy a agregar más abajo el tiempo. Uh -huh. Launch time. Sí, sí. One hour. Launch. Yes. One hour. Okay. Remember, you can add more days if you want to the to the schedule. You can add also Saturday and and Sunday, right? Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. Good. <clears throat> okay. Quiero ver. Ok. Vamos a poner. Miss, calla el cielo. Thanks, teacher. Hi. Qué alegría. I saw the message. I saw the message. It says. Eh. Kathy Briseida is asking for help. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, tell me. Eh, fíjense, eh, nuestra interrogante es sobre, vamos a hacer el cuadro sobre nosotras tres o cada quien sobre su equipo de trabajo de su empresa. Oh, no, you can say just, you can create just one chart with uh one of i mean one of one example of your one of your company not not necessary all the three companies it could be mm -hmm. just one mm -hmm. or you can you can use imaginary names or imaginary employees it doesn't matter oh es que teníamos esa duda y como yo no había escuchado le preguntaba a ella porque en indicación era de cinco empleados de la compañía Uh -huh. Y yo lo estaba haciendo así, pues como no escuchaba. Uh -huh. Ok. Pero no. ya se hace mejor. Yes, or you can create one company, you can invent, you can um, um, just imagine that you have one company and then create a schedule for you, your employees. It doesn't matter. What matter is that you create the schedule and then explain it. Okay. Explain okay. explain the, the schedule of the employees. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay. Uh, also, you can add Monday, right? If you want to add the seven days of the week, it's, it's okay. Okay, you can add Monday uh, and Sunday too.
agregaría Monday. Leticia. Leticia. Yes. Oh. Ok. Ah, plural. Yes, poli, 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 polygraph test. There is correct teacher. Polygraph test. Polygraph. I guess it is. Okay. So we have to put two day off. So on Tuesday and Thursday, uh, Julio. Eh, ah, sí, 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 perdón. Yeah. <laughs> sí, sí, me emocioné y los copié todo, ¿cierto? Sí. Have, <laughs> you, have you taken one polygraph no. test in your life? Yes, yes teacher. I, I have just one. <laughs> I was applying <laughs> okay. for, I was applying for uh, an app a position in the airport and I failed that. I didn't continue with the process. Oh. <laughs> yes. Because I, doubt, I doubt one question. They try to make you try like a confused that they mm -hmm. ask you different questions. So they want that you make a mistakes when they mm -hmm. made the political path. Yes, so. But it's like if you say, uh, for example, if they ask you a question, and you have to answer this question, but in, but they ask you the same question again, and if you may give another um, answer, so they put the this answer like a, like a bat because you changed your answer. Correct. Yes. Y así me dice mi compañero, porque mi compañero, eh, con el que es de las pruebas, él dice que sí es más que todo. Si alguien cuando este, le pregunta una vez algo y se lo vuelve a preguntar y se lo vuelve a preguntar otra vez, y si en las tres veces usted cambió de versión o no dijo lo mismo, ya lo toman como mal. Y es como uh -huh. que <ríe> hay que tratar de recordarse lo que uno dijo, más que todo. Yes. They are, they are tricky. Yes, teacher. Okay, uh, Julio. So, <clears throat> another is um. Is it possible to fold the polygraph? It is. Where? It is possible uh, it to fail the polygraph, yes. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. It, it is. is. Yeah. There are more percentages, more percentage that you can fail than pass it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. But it's not like the people said that it's physical, physical. Not because uh, someone said because you put nervous and you move the the machine, and for that reason you you fail the 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 test not is that is because the the polygraph polygrapher makes mm -hmm. you a lot of questions and you feel confused and for mm -hmm. that is most I think that is more psychology than physical. Yes, uh, the problem is that you have uh, a lot of cables around you, so you feel like ah, uh, I don't know, frustrated with. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Es que ellos lo hacen creer que el aparato lo, este, lo va a hacer hablar. Uh -huh. Y en algunas personas funciona. Porque se ponen nerviosa y comienzan a decir este, la verdad por la misma nerviosidad. Ay, no. Pero sí, se ha dado. Entonces, este, ¿cómo se llama? Pero sí toman en cuenta... Este, lo que es este los movimientos, ¿verdad? Pero a veces no, porque hay bastante gente, como me dice mi compañero, que se mueve bastante durante el test uh -huh. y este casi no se toma en cuenta eso, sino que lo como cómo responde, la veracidad, como le dicen. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Another uh, uh, Julio is um, gone. Uh, Smith. I don't know if good. Uh, Smith. Tenemos tiempo, but teacher. Yes, you have time. So we have we have a lot of time. Okay, thirty minutes. Let me <laughs> see. I will give you another ten minutes. Ten okay. minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. We have the, we have the idea. We're making that schedule right now. Okay. But so you can share your screen, guys. I allow you to do it. Okay. It is active that multiple participants can share. Roberto is the is is the maker of the schedule. Okay, Robert. Yes. Okay. Que proyecte lo que acaba lo que estamos haciendo. Ah, va. Okay. Give me, a moment. Give me a moment, please. Ah, ahorita. Okay, let me see. Okay, okay it will be around you can, if you, you need see? help. Just let me know, okay? Yes, good. That's good. Remember, you can change it also. Uh, oh, the days. The days. Uh, you have so Saturday, Sundays. Yes, you can include all the days. Good. Very good. Uh, I I need to add two, two person, a supervisor and a boss. Robert is a quality control. Uh, I put the name in operator. I change for quality control. Okay, good. Okay, guys, I will be around. If you need help, please let me know. Okay, thanks, teacher. Thank you. Teacher. Hi. Eh, how do you say bodeguero o encargado de bodega? Warehouse. Um, let me see. Warehouse is bodega. Will be uh -huh. warehouse manager. Mm -hmm. Because okay. who is who manage the warehouse, right? Okay. And. Transportista. That will be. That will be driver. Um, driver, yes, the driver. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Company driver. driver. Company driver. Mm. Sí. <laughs> Company driver. Company driver. Okay. Remember, okay. remember, you can share your screen. You have the permission to do it. Uh, we already finished it. Just, uh, I'm making some changes. Ah, oh, okay, good. Uh, so you can practice. I will give you another extra five minutes, and then I will. Okay. Uh, I will um close the rooms. Okay. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Meanwhile, I'm going right. to take my, my uh -huh. dinner. Warehouse manager. Okay. Uh -huh. Vaya. Eh, cleaning, eh, C -L -E. eh, cleaning, así. Ajá, cleaning, cabal, cleaning. Uh -huh. Ajá, eh, separado, S, T, A, F, F. Eh. Start cleaning. Start está y Pedro sería eh... podemos poner los de cachir. Ajá. You want to say salesperson in the first uh, position? 
salesperson, right? Salesperson. Ah, is it Maria is salesperson? Uh-huh. So be careful with the spelling there. Sales per son. It's separated. No, no, it's okay uh, together, but it will be person, okay? Como persona. Person. Ah, uh -huh. uh, no. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, okay. Así. So, per, per, person. That is person. P. E-R-S-O-N. Uh, uh. Ok. Después de sales es P-E-R-S-O-N. Person. Person. Gracias. Mm. Okay. ¿Por qué no ponemos a esta persona de como en orden de, 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 de importancia? Ah, vaya, está bien. Ajá, cambié el lugar. Entonces, el pre María debería de ser el manager o el gerente. ¿Verdad? ¿Sí? Sí. Ok, entonces... Y seguimos el mismo ejemplo este. Tendríamos a María. Starting around the night a.m. Ajá, uh, night a.m. Night a.m. to... To... to 4 p.m. o no sé... 5 p.m. Uh -huh. Okay, guys. 6 p.m. I will give you another five minutes, okay? Because almost everybody is 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 um done, but I will give okay. you five minutes extra, okay? Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. Roosevelt. No, otra. A la ruta militar, quizás. Esa, esa, esa. How are you doing, guys? Ah, uh, yeah. Excuse me, teacher. I, uh, I'm searching in one direction. <laughs> teacher, uh, with Mauricio, we have to do uh, like a daily routine or schedule. Uh -huh. uh, for example, uh, Monday daily schedule could be with with first group: Carol, Maria, Jules, Fields, Jack, Daniela, and, and you, maybe Eddie. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, we got work to share. Okay. The second day, Tuesday, or second chip, yes? It's called reset chip. Chip, yes. Chip, the, the second chip uh, is Mauricio, Carla, Daniela, Dari, Thiago, Daniela, and Edith. Uh, uh, Mauricio? Yes. Uh, you can, may I explain more detail of our picture, please? Yes. Okay. Well, this is the, the schedule from the day uh, Monday mm -hmm. or, or Tuesday, Carlos? This is for Monday. Okay, this is Monday. Okay, uh, well, we we are stay. Uh, uh, ¿Cómo se dice? Rotando, teacher, los los turnos. Rotating. 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 Rotating the shift. Rotating mm -hmm. the shift. Okay. Uh, for example, the we have. Supervisor um, Daniela, she rest on the, the day mm, off is on Tuesday. Tuesday, 
And uh, supervisor number two, the day off is on Monday. Okay. Okay. After that, they, uh, I don't know if you can put the Wednesday. Okay, Wednesday. Yes. Yes, yes. Here. Yes. Here. We again shift the, uh, the some, uh, uh, some uh, how can I say, uh, puestos, positions, Roll. positions, yeah. positions or roles. Uh -huh. Okay, the, the different positions. For example, uh, the cashiers. We have the day cashier. We have a, a opening cashier, day cashier, and uh, closing cashier. Okay. okay. Be okay. careful with Wednesday schedule. It's um. It says that I have lunch at one p.m., but my my end time is at eleven a.m. So it doesn't match. So in that case, change the end time. Ah, uh, excuse me. Uh... So in my position, it says supervisor two. So. Uh -huh. A start time is at 6 a.m., right? Then yeah. I have a break at 9, lunch yes. time at 1, but then my, my end time, ah. what time would be? Oh, yes. Ah, okay, yeah. is... Uh... There's a mistake in this in this, in this this mm -hmm. time. That time. Yeah. Okay, in this in this case, uh, edit, end time, 11. So... The break is okay. The lunch time. Uh, I don't have time. I don't yes, have lunch I, time. Uh -huh. Yes, of course. The end because... time will be at five o'clock at five p.m. We have to change uh, Carlos the end time. Will be at five p.m. Uh, who? Yeah. Mr. Edith. Yeah. Edith. Yes. Uh, but the two supervisors were. Until six p. Until five p.m. So you can okay. rotate, rotate the supervisors. It could oh, be okay. if your if your work working hours are are from six to eleven p.m. Mm -hmm. or to five or to six p.m. So you can add uh like uh part time to to both of them, right? One that covering the morning shift morning shift and the other cover the afternoon shift yes yeah uh, edit works uh, in the morning mm -hmm. and daniela in the second part of the day mm -hmm. okay yes, she, Good. she answered it uh 11 a.m until 5 p.m yes mm -hmm. oh it's like okay that. yeah mm -hmm. yeah you had the reason okay mm -hmm. there yeah. you can uh, delete the, the break because she has lunch at 12, right? Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Like that? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's, uh, don't have sense. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay, guys, I'm going to stop here because you're going to explain to everybody. Uh, we're going to stop okay. and I'm going to close the rooms, okay? Okay, okay. thank you. Good, teacher. good. Thank you. Hello, teacher. Hello, I'm here. You, Just waiting you, for the rest. Okay, do you feel better today? Oh, yes, I'm okay. I yes. just, I am tired because yes. I get up at 5 a.m. today. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yes. Yes, I'm good. Yes. Yes. Anyways, but I had to do it. Last mm -hmm. week, you are already sick, right? Yeah, allergy. Ah, it's allergy. Oh, allergy okay. only. Mm -hmm. Yes, you had a couple um, 
wine is okay. It's, it's very healthy. Okay. <laughs> I will take your advice. <laughs> <laughs> no, not too sure. <laughs> Before the glass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> to be happy. Yes. Okay. Prednisona is electric. Prednisona. <laughs> 5MG. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. So let me start. Okay, let me see. The breakout rooms. Do you want to be volunteers or do you want uh, the wheels of names? Are we sure? Volunteers, or I can create the wills of names to. Hello, Carlos. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, teacher. Uh, I, I try to explain this sculpture to each other. Okay, you can share your screen. Okay, teacher. Okay, confirm, please, that you see this sketch. Yes, sketchable. I can see. Okay, uh, with Mauricio, I try to do um, a schedule day for day. Uh, we don't finish the week, yes, uh, only to do three days uh, of Monday to Wednesday. But the idea is uh, we have two groups and they have to uh combine or, or uh, achieve right uh the the monday the first group has a uh, carol maria jules phil chats daniela and, and edith this company uh is uh sell of, of tools of the car yes uh the role is opening cashier, day cashier, customer service, closing cashier, and we have two supervisors. And the idea is the employees uh, take a day off. For example, in the case of our supervisor, uh, Eddie, take day off uh, Monday and uh, Daniela take day off. Tuesday. Uh, Mauricio? Yes. Please help me. Okay. Uh, this is the day Tuesday. Okay. We yes. have yes. a. Uh, okay. Okay. We have a. Uh, uh, for example, three. His. Uh, from cashier, we have the day cashier, opening cashier, uh, day cashier, and clothing cashier. And they have a chief um, from time to time. For example, opening cashier uh, start time at 6 a.m. Uh, uh, they they have brief break at nine uh, fifty fifteen a.m. Uh, launched and he end time at eleven a.m. Uh, the day off uh, is on. Mm, oh, the no, there's no date off for, for yeah, that. We still don't have yet day off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Is the for uh, the supervisor have the day off? For example, the supervisor number one, the day off is the Wednesday, and for the supervisor number two, the day off is on Monday. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's all. 
Oh, in between the 11 to 1, mm -hmm. who is the cashier? Because I, that, I can see that it's on a space there be, that between two hours this day on Monday. The cashier, excuse me, this one. Who is the cashier? <laughs> that is on a space with without cashier from 11 to 1 because the opening cashier is, is finished at 11 and then the others start at 1. Uh, we have, uh, yes, yes, I understand. Uh, uh, the closing cashier, uh, we have two uh, mistakes here. Uh, the closing cashier will start to time uh, 11 a.m. Mm. Yes. Okay. Yes. But, uh, uh, Carlos, sorry. Uh, from the opening cashier continues the day cashier from the 9 a.m. to ah, 11. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, oh, yes. you are right. There are three. Yes, yes mm -hmm. there are three, three cashier. Ah. Yes, because it exists the day cashier. Yes. Ah, okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah, this is the the space that you mentioned. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Do you have another day? Just Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Okay. Yes. Uh, I think that we have more time to finish this week, teacher. But uh, mm. only to do okay. three days. Yes. It's okay because you you did it in a different way, like a daily daily schedule. Okay, good. Thank you so much, both of you. Very okay. good. Okay, thank you. Okay, volunteers for team two. Me, teacher. We are ready, teacher. Me, teacher. Okay, Gilberto, and then did you work Very with? Self. Okay, Gilberto, and then Carlos. Then Robert, no, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, thanks. Uh, Okay, Hazel. Okay. Hazel. Voy a empezar. Schedule at the restaurant Delicious Chicken. Uh, schedule the ma Mario, the, the work on the weekend, Monday, cashier, uh, cashier, Monday, Wednesday, Wednesday, day off. Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, starting working a a a n a n twelve p.m. Uh, an hour the breaks an hour break. Is and Saturday. Uh, working 6, 6 p.m., 11 p.m., 30 minutes, the break. Hola, hola. Yes. Okay. Me escuchar. Yes. Thank you so yes. much. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Maria has the, the schedule to, sorry, Carla. The um, schedule is 8 a.m. to 12 a.m. One hour, one hour break, and she is hostess. And Maria uh, is server uh, to 1 p.m. at uh, 5 p.m. One hour break, and his sec her second shift is to uh, 6 p.m. at 11 p.m. with 30 minutes break, uh, always uh, on Saturday. And for Sunday, Carla is hostess at uh, 2 a.m. to 12 a.m. with one hour break. And then Marcos uh, is a cashier to 1 p.m. Uh, with 2, 5 p.m. with one hour break. And his second shift is to 6 p.m. at 
11 p.m. with 30 minutes break. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay, that is the only information that you that you have, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay, uh who will be in team number three? Okay, we are ready, teacher, with Mauricio Benavides. Okay, Robert and Mauricio, go ahead. Mauricio, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, we are share the, the sketch. The sketch. You can see it? teacher. Not yet. Oh, let me stop sharing my. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I will stop sharing my escape my presentation in order you can share your. Okay. What happens? Oh. Here. I can see it now. Okay, you can see. It? Yes, very good. Okay, uh, we are talking about the following schedule. This schedule or this schedule is of my company. The name of company is Confeccione del Valle. And this schedule is for, for this week. You can see the the day. And the day is, is Monday to Monday to Friday. Mm -hmm. And for example, uh, number one employees is Esmeralda. And she is she is an operator and she starts work at she starts working at 7 15 a.m. to to 40 to 4 45 p.m. This is Monday to Monday to Friday and you can you can see the 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 hour worth of day um the break or oh, for lunch break is 30 minutes 35 minutes every day and Saturday and Sunday is day off only at the company only work overtime if it's necessary, but but sometimes it is of day because right now the the work at the company is very is very difficult for for the pandemic. For that reason, uh, we are we are working only forty four hours a week. And you can see the second employee is Maria. She is operator too. And the the hours works at the whip is the same because the cheese is the same for, for the company. For that reason, is the 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 hour works a day is is the same. And right now, uh, Mauricio Benavides uh, continue with the presentation. Okay. Robert worked as a quality control, Carlos as a, as a supervisor, and now Fuente as a operation manager. All, all they have the same schedule shift, and they have 30 minutes for break, a lunch break at 12 o'clock. They, they date off our Saturday on Sundays, and that's all the schedule of the team. Okay. okay, teacher. This is the the presentation of the schedule about my company. Um, the hour is the same because all company work with the same hours. Okay, all very good. Too. Good. Just be careful with the spelling. Supervisor. It is a oh, o, o instead of. Okay. E. Okay. Thanks for. For advice, I I can 
code I can repair right now. Okay, good. Really good schedule. It looks uh very organized. Okay, thank you so much. Thanks, teacher. Okay, team number four. Mm -hmm. Team number four. What is Lady Kathy and Maria Leticia? I cannot hear you. Guys. ¿Sí me escuchan? Yes. Okay. Yes. yes. <laughs> Ahora? Yes, I, now yes. Hoy sí me escucha? Yes, we can hear you. Hola. Yes. Hola, Leticia. Hola, hola. Sí, la podemos escuchar. Okay. Puede escucharnos. Yes. Ok. Now, yes. Eh, eh, this is a schedule of different positions and different companies. Ok. Eh, Bueno, no nos pusimos de acuerdo si cada quien iba a leer eh, la, la, eh, lo, nuestros horarios. You can do it. Uh -huh. You can read yours and Katy can read hers and Lady the same. Ok. Um, Diré el mío. Yes. Leti y Pharmacy Clerk de the... the schedule the schedule is um, between nine to six between this Monday and Saturday in different hours, horario. Different, <laughs> different times. Mm -hmm. Different time is um, Monday the night I am in 6 p.m. Wednesday day off. Wednesday is, is igual. <laughs> And night I am in 6 p.m. The same. Mm -hmm. The same. Swiss day off. And free day. Now night I am 6 p.m. And Saturday is 8 I am and 3 p.m. With um, or the break. break. Mm hmm En, bueno, en los días laborales. <laughs> ok. One, uh, one hour break. One or hour lunch time. Break. Uh -huh. In the uh, days that you work. Ok. Do you work also Monday? I'm oh, sorry, Sunday? Sunday. Yes. Okay, Day you ha you have just two days off. Okay, Tuesday and Thursday, right? Yes. Okay. Tomorrow will be your day your day off. Yes. Okay. I'm sorry, uh, Maria Leticia, where are you, is your pharmacy located? 
y pharmacy, dependiente de farmacia. Dep yes, but where is located? ¿Dónde está la, la, la farmacia? Um, San Rafael Obrajuelo, La Paz. Oh, ok. Mm. Ya le iba a decir, algún día voy a ir a su farmacia. <laughs> no, hoy puede venir. <laughs> <laughs> ok, but it's far okay. away. Ok, good. Uh, Katy, what about you? Ok, um, I am a content. Schedule Monday to Friday from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Um, one hour the break every day. And Saturday from 8 to 11, rest on Saturday afternoon. Okay. And Sunday. Miss, <clears throat> yes, um, in my case, um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, uh, 7 30 a.m. to 12. 12. Mm -hmm. I visit a school for. ¿Cómo diría acompañamiento y seguimiento de clases? To monitor and follow. Um, uh -huh. Monitor and follow the classes or workshops. Workshops. And the afternoon is to meet information. Okay. So you have the same schedule every day from from seven thirty to four. You don't have a short day. That one day you will end before four. Mm. No, right? Early. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Others day I I give the workshops. Capacite, uh, como capacitaciones, o sea, hay días que son de seis visitas a escuelas y otros que son de dar talleres. Ok. Good. So I develop workshops. Ok. Good. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. Team number five. What is, oh no, team number five, no. Team number six, what is Mauricio Benavides and Roberto? We, we pass. Oh, already. you already did, sorry. Yes. yes, you are right. Rodrigo Morales and Silvia? We are here. Okay. Can I share the, the screen, please? Sure, you can do it. Okay. Uh, please confirm if you can see it. Yes, we can see it. Okay. Well, this is our ske uh, schedule. Uh, we fuse uh, our company schedule from Sylvia and myself. So this is the between this uh, on uh, this is the schedule from this week from September 11 to uh, September September 15. Mm -hmm. is we have uh, five persons in this case so i will begin with in this case myself okay uh, rodrigo is the purchase person uh, my schedule my my schedule is uh, from 9 a.m for for 2 4 p.m and i have a uh, 30 minutes of break Mm -hmm. from uh, 7 30 a.m. It has the fight 10, pardon, 10 minute breath. 
Eh, Alejandro is the work. The Alejandro warehouse manager. Eh, sería from eh, 8, 8 a.m. Eh, to 5 p.m. Eh, the sería he has the 30 minute breakfast. Breakfast, perdón. Silvia, in this case, is the company driver. Uh, she begins to work at 8.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. And she has uh, 30 minutes of break. And in, for ultimate, Tatiana is the manager. Uh, she begins uh, from 7.30 to 8 p.m. And she has uh, 25 minutes of break. It is so important to say that, that all the people have a have day off on September 15 because it's a holiday, as you know. And this is our schedule. Oh, okay, okay. Why does the, the manager has left a minute break? <laughs> because it's the manager. <laughs> because he's the manager. <laughs> okay. And, and and he and he and and she she needs to work uh, and as 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 a slave because that wow terrible <laughs> i don't want to be a manager no <laughs> nobody yeah. wants to do it, it happens for real life it it happens in the so... in the indu in the industrial com in the in, on the industrial company it happens mm -hmm. especially the the production managers Yes, uh, it is. It is true that they earn uh more money, right? But they they work double mm -hmm. as they work as they earn. So it means that they they are they deserve that that um salary, right? Yeah. Okay. Good. Very good. Thank you so much. Oh, I am missing. Let me see. Mm -mm. What is Andres? Andres, right? You're, yes, teacher. You're pending. Andres yeah. Julio. Yes, teacher. Julio, are you, aren't you there? Okay, Julio. So, teacher... We create like a group um, like in a schedule from uh, employees from my company. So, okay. so I'm going to say the one and then my partner Julio, the, the other one, and it's like that. Voy a decir primero Julio, primero yo uno, y después usted el otro, y así consecutivamente. Okay, the first one. From Monday to Friday, Mary is a receptionist. She has a schedule that a a to a a a m to four p m. She receives calls in the in all the day, but he has a lunch time um, in uh, twelve o'clock, and she has a uh, one hour. But because 60, September 60 is a day off because from depend, Independence Day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm. Julio? Julio? Sorry, sorry. Ya casi estaba terminando. <laughs> In <laughs> mute. <laughs> okay. In this case, is Saul. He is a, a polygrapher. Uh, Saul work a uh, one day one day work a uh, one day uh, rest. Uh, in this week, uh, Saul work uh, on Monday, uh, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, he worked from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Uh, making polygraphic tests. Uh, he, uh, he had uh, one hour of lunch. Uh, okay. 
and the Friday uh, he rest for the day of uh, the day the Independence Day. Okay. Just a teacher that he has a flexible schedule. schedule. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Okay, the other one is the Mauricio, that he is a gunsmith. I don't know if correct uh, the definition or the meaning of gunsmith. What is the name in Spanish? Uh, the people, the men that fix the gums, armero. Mm. Let me double check. Yeah. Yes, it's correct. Oh, it's okay, a person teacher. who makes cells and also repair. Repair uh -huh. weapons. Okay, teacher. So he has a schedule that from Monday to Friday, that is um, a, the a.m. to 4 p.m. In his activities, he fixed camps and he has a lunch time that is one hour. And of course, he rests on Friday because he's at the Independence Day. Okay, good. Next Julio. is uh, Nelson. Uh, he is a security guard. Uh, Nelson has a 24 hours of um, laboral day. And he worked uh, 24 hours in, in next is a day off. In this case, in this case of in the case of the week of the present week, and Nelson worked on Monday, uh, Wednesday, and Friday. Um, take a day off on Thursday and Thursday. Uh, tal. Bueno, eh, on Monday, Nelson works eh, for 24 hours. Eh, he brings security. Uh, he works. Eh, he takes a lunch from 2 p.m. to uh, 3 p.m. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So. And the last wow. one to change. Difficult schedule, 24 hours. It's difficult more for um, if someone is working a gas station. Mm, okay. Yeah, they can uh, they can sleep in, in in all for twenty four hours. Yes. Okay. Uh, Peter, Peter is the manager, and he has a schedule from Monday to Friday. He start works uh, em. 8 a.m. to um, finish work at uh, 3 p.m. And he, in his activity, he manages staff and he has a lunch time that is one hour. And so he rests in, on Friday because he's an uh, independent state. Mm -hmm. That is a really good schedule for that manager. Uh in that yes. position, yes, I want to be the money. <laughs> <laughs> yes, teacher. And I told you the, to to Julio that sometimes he works uh, less hours. Really? Because, yeah, yeah. Because the it's like a he decides um, if he has activity on a, or like an emergency, he can say that uh, I have to go out right now. So I see you tomorrow. So, mm. but he, uh, yeah. Because it's the manager, so mm -hmm. we don't say nothing, yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, good. Sofia and Rolando, you will uh, do it tomorrow, okay? Because we don't have time today. Sorry. Okay, you, teacher. You're yeah, going to do it tomorrow, okay? First. Okay, teacher. First activities. Okay. Um. And also we are missing the homework, okay? Homework number 11. 
if you have time to do it, do it right now. If not, we're going to, to complete them tomorrow, the two of them, okay? Thank you, Thank you so much for your attendance, guys. Um, see you tomorrow at the same time. Have a nice uh, rest of the, well, the week and also tonight. Okay, have a good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow. See you.